continues to stand behind his decision to fire FBI Director James Comey. But regardless of recommendation, I was going to fire Comey, knowing there was no good time to do it. I was going to fire Comey. My decision. It was not. You had made the decision before they came uh, in. The I, I was going to fire Comey. Tonight, President Trump exclusively telling NBC News he planned to fire the now former FBI director James Comey, regardless of a recommendation from the DOJ. It's a different story from what the White House said Tuesday. No one from the White House. That was that was a uh, a DOJ decision. Wednesday, Vice President Mike Pence again reiterated the DOJ's role. Because of the actions that the deputy attorney general outlined, to act on the recommendations, to take the recommendation of the deputy attorney general. Now the White House deflecting questions on the revised rationale. This shouldn't be a complicated process. The president knew that Director Comey was not up to the task. The president saying Comey was incompetent, among other things. He's a showboat. He's a grandstander. Senator Lindsey Graham coming to the president's defense, saying Comey had lost support from both Republicans and Democrats, but he was alarmed to hear the president call him a showboat. I just don't think that's necessary. I appreciate that. Uh, Director Comey's service in a variety of roles. Senator Richard Burr assuring the public that the Senate Intelligence Committee will aggressively pursue an investigation into a possible Russian interference with the election. The investigation that's done by the Senate Intelligence Committee will continue. And we know that Comey had recently asked for more resources to investigate the Trump campaign and any possible ties with the Russian government. So many are raising eyebrows now at the timing of his firing. I'm live in Charlotte tonight. Rachel Brown, NBC Charlotte. Thank you, Rachel. New tonight, Governor Cooper.